Hey, it's the only VPN's team here. In this video, we'll be doing an IP Vanish review. We'll be covering IP Vanish's pricing, security, speed, and a final recommendation. Before we dive in, I just wanted to mention that we'll have discounted links to IP Vanish and other VPNs in the description down below this video. These are affiliate links, and if IP Vanish isn't the best option, we'll be sure to have links to alternatives that might better suit your needs. With this quick intro out of the way, let's dive into the IP Vanish review. Let's start off by covering pricing. IP Vanish has two main types of plans, a VPN only plan and a VPN plus storage plan. Here we'll be covering only the VPN prices. From a pricing perspective, IP Vanish's monthly plan starts out very cheap compared to other VPN monthly plans at $3.49, but quickly jumps up to $9.99 after the first month. The same could be said about the first year option of IP Vanish, which is just $31.49, but then jumps up to $89.99 per year. In our opinion, the initial price terms are great, but you may be better off with a different provider if you're committing for two or more years. In terms of security, IP Vanish has the basics that most users would want from a VPN in terms of security. For starters, it uses 256-bit encryption, which is basically unbreakable even from brute force attacks. IP Vanish also has DNS leak protection, which keeps your IP address from being revealed to websites. And they've got a kill switch, keeping your IP address from being exposed if there are connection issues. They also do not keep any logs with their strict no logs policy. One downside from a security standpoint with IP Vanish is that it does not have a built-in ad blocker. This isn't a big deal for everyone, as many people have ad blockers on their browser already, but it's worth noting. It also struggles to work with China's firewall, which may be important to some of you watching. When we look at speed, IP Vanish finishes around average when we compare it to other VPNs. In general, VPNs will be slightly slower than your normal connection, but they did a good enough job. Netflix streamed well from various countries in our trials, and they were able to stream everything that I tested. There are some other things worth mentioning about IP Vanish. Their app is straightforward and should be easy for almost anyone to use. They've also got solid customer support and reply quickly. IP Vanish does not have a free trial at this time, but they do offer a 30-day money-back guarantee. Overall, for the average user, IP Vanish is a decent choice. However, we do think there are better options like ExpressVPN and NordVPN, which we'll have discounts links to in the description down below. They both have more options and streamed at faster rates when we tested them against other VPNs. Be sure to check them out if you're looking for a top tier VPN option. Regardless of which VPN option that you choose to go with, we appreciate you watching this IP Vanish review. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and feel free to subscribe to the Only VPNs channel.